Hey everyone, Julio Rodriguez here for Card Player TV with an Elite 8 update. First, starting with the Spades and Clubs bracket, Scotty Wynn defeated Jason Mercier, and we talked to him after his match. Thank you, thank you. You know, feel, uh, feel uh, good, you know, and uh, I, I, uh, I, I've been playing this for the last four or five years, and, and the most I, I, I ever get close is Sweet 16 last, last year, you know. Now, just like more focus and relax and you know, try uh, try to play my uh, my my game. Plus, I haven't played poker for long for a long time. You know, it's just like when you when when you don't play poker every day, you miss it. You know, you uh, and 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 the more you miss the game, you play better. You get more patient than the rest of them out there. Especially Jason is just like he would love to, to knock out Scotty Win. You know what I mean? He 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 puts some in. He's not supposed to do, to do, you know what I mean? So, so many hands he can throw in the way, but he didn't, you know. He 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 put, he puts he, his luck, but it, the luck is on 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 my my side. Eric Seidel's next, baby. That's all I'm I'm gonna tell you. In the other match, Eric Seidel defeated Peter Eastgate. In the other half of the bracket, Andy Duke defeated Jerry Yang in a marathon match, and we talked to her after play ended. They're not making it easy. I gotta tell you what. I mean. You know, the, the interesting thing about it, though, was had I lost, I wouldn't have felt bad about it because I feel like that match, I actually played my, my best poker so far this whole tournament, and I'm going to be really proud. That's one that I'm going to be proud to have on TV. So whichever way it had gone, I feel like what people will see from my hold cards would have made me proud. So that's sort of what I was trying to focus on as opposed to the actual results of those hands. With that, the final four is set, so be sure to keep it locked on Card Player for all your results and updates. I'm Hula Rodriguez for Card Player TV.